to talk about something. If you want, I can get your dad. Uh, but I'm going to have to sit down since I'm old. So. Oh, perfect. There's a chair right here. This is good. I'm not who you think I am. Sure, I'm an old man, but I'm not a monster. And listen, I know that things are tough right now with you moving to your pop's house and with the divorce and everything. And I know your mom's going to say this is just a phase, but I know it's not. Have you told your dad yet? Wait, before you respond, let me just say your dad kissed a lot of boys in his days. Yeah, your mom wouldn't want me telling you about this, but I don't like your mom. You didn't know that? Well, she's never liked me, and she loved your man. Nan was the sweetest thing. Did you know I was actually in love with someone before your man? And yeah, that person was a guy. Yeah, your past was somewhat of a... What do the kids say? A gay icon. Oh shit, we're getting off topic. What, am I not allowed to say shit? You're turning 15 soon, and uh, you can handle some curse words. But back to your mother. Hmm? You don't want me to talk about her? Alright, fine. I was talking about the man I was in love with. If it wasn't for the time and his death and the laws, I would have married him. Don't get me wrong, I loved your nan. I'm glad I married her, especially because I wouldn't have had your father and he wouldn't have had you. We wouldn't be having this conversation. But yeah, Vin was such a sweetheart. That man knew the way to my heart. He had the key to my heart until he passed away. He passed it on to your nan. I know he would have wanted that, but enough about my life, although I know it's quite interesting. Let's talk about this name you've chosen, Dylan. It's such a cute name. I love it, and it fits you so much better than the name your mother picked out for you. You're asking to pronounce it so well. Hey, let's go shopping and get you some clothes that'll fit you. My treat, I insist. 